Kenya is set to launch its first op operational observational satellite into space in its bid to provide the country with a timely and regular data in fields such as agriculture, food security and general environmental monitoring. Acting Director of the Kenya Space Agency, Brigadier Hilary Kipkoske, says the mission will put Kenya on the global map for its contribution to the growth of satellite engineering and social economic development. The satellite dubbed Taifa One is said to improve the country's monitoring capabilities as well as land use mapping in the fight against natural disasters. Accurate weather forecasting information, up to 14 days weather forecast, accurate. And that is information that that Mamamboga there in the village in Kisi can go into, uh, create, click a link and uh, input the county, input the sub-county, include the ward, and that Mamamboga will be able to see accurate weather information for the next 14 days. I think that is valid. That is where we are going. Further, we want to spy interest in the country. So far, all the satellite imagery we use in the country is foreign, and it is not cheap as it comes. The ones that are free are not very high resolution. The Kenya Space Agency is set to launch the first operational 3U Earth Observation Satellite, Taifa 1 Satellite, on April 11, 2023, and will be aided by Space Exploration Technologies Corporation, SpaceX, in Vanderbilt Bay, California, aboard Falcon 9 rocket. The reason why we are using the launch facility in North America is because that is the nearest route to the orbit that we are targeting. Because this is a small satellite, we are not launching it alone. We are launching it on a ride share, on a ride share program with other users or other customers. Taifa One Sat is a stepping stone to the development of what is planned to be a constellation of small earth observation satellites for Kenya. Tasking a satellite and acquiring an imagery at will at the time that we want. And if we see the need, if we appreciate the importance of that or the value of that, then we can you know, invest in more capable systems. It is also a capacity building effort for Kenya's engineers in space systems engineering, space operations, ground receiver station operations, mission control, and satellite data acquisition and processing, among others. Kenya's development in space systems engineering capabilities began with the design, development, and eventual successful launch of the first Kenya University nano satellite, Precursor Flight 1 Kunz PF. The satellite was jointly developed by the University of Nairobi and the Sapienza University of Rome, with launch support offered by the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency and the United Nations Office of Outer Space Affairs. Alan Oko, Lunchtime News.